out, out of office, um, he was paid over £120,000 to address this year's uh, India Today conclave, uh, which is also attended by the Indian Prime Minister Modi. Uh, this was only about four months ago. Uh, but counterintuitively, I think this will uh, make him take a much tougher stance on India to uh, avoid accusations of pay to play. Uh, at this conclave, they were introducing him as a future prime minister. So the image, if he doesn't take a tough stance, it will look very bad for him. Uh, in regards to Pakistan and the British government's response, uh, Boris Johnson's national security advisor and the cabinet secretary is a chap called Sir Mark Sedwell. And he was uh, Britain's deputy high commissioner in Pakistan from 2003 to 2005. And the UK special representative to Pakistan and Afghanistan in 2011, 2012. Now, he is the guy advising the prime minister, giving him, you know, up to date, minute to minute advice on what's going on in the region. He understands Pakistan exceptionally well. Uh, and um, having him sort of as Boris's point man on this, uh, I think he's very good. Um, the additional thing that I'd like to add in a sort of court of public opinion um, perspective is that uh, the Pakistani um, uh, um, Prime Minister Imran Khan is an absolutely beloved figure here in the United Kingdom. Uh, and we still remember him as... Uh, a sort of straw-struckling cricketer. And uh, I think having um, uh, him as... 